what is up everybody so today we are hitting legs and this is going to be the first full like leg day video i did one probably was like my fourth or fifth video something like that and it was like a only like a six and a half minute video because during my bulk i was doing two leg days a week and that was just like my lighter leg day out of the two did like did less exercises on that day and i didn't up the weight at all i just did 225 for a lot of reps but now that i'm on the cut we're doing leg day once a week since we're on the bro split so this is episode two of the bro split if you think about it that way because i filmed arms last week and now this week we're doing legs so today is the fourth of july happy fourth of july everybody um it's about 7 30 and i'm a little tired right now just downed all my pre and all that stuff so hopefully that kicks in a little bit um yeah it's set i'm hoping there's not a lot of people at the gym right now i like to go I had a later time on the days that I record. That way I don't got a bunch of people in there staring, looking at me like I'm an idiot or something. But I'm pretty excited about this workout, even though I don't sound it. Leg day is one of my favorite days. And I mean, even though you gotta work a little bit harder than normal on leg day, Exercises might suck a little bit in the results when you got some good looking legs when you got some tree trunks It's all definitely worth it So we're gonna get in here Do a job and get out and first exercise I'm gonna start with is My favorite leg exercise Of all time right now Of course, I forgot to say this today day 23 of the cut so that means we have eight weeks and five days left after today and we were 235 at the start of the cut and now this morning we were 214 so that is 22 pounds yeah 22 pounds and i some people might question why was I taking creatine uh, if I'm on the cut because it holds water and things like that. If you got a good diet and you're doing things the right way, uh, the creatine really shouldn't affect you. Will it hold some water? Some? Will I be a little? Will I have a little more water than if I wasn't taking it? Yes. Yes, maybe a little bit. But that's also why I'm cutting it. I'm cutting the creatine out. Um, I haven't really decided when, but I think it's going to be somewhere like two weeks from when I do my little photo shoot because, you know, I got to have some fun with it, right? I got to treat this like the real deal. Just a little test run here. Just having some fun with it. Why would I not have a photo shoot by the time I'm done? I'd be wasting my time if I didn't want to do that. So, see you at the gym. This is freaking... Oh, let's go, dude. Let's freaking go. Nobody here. All right, exercise uno. Got an empty gym, so we'll be able to talk real nice today. So, typically, I would start with normal barbell squats, not off the Smith machine. I was actually an anti-Smith machine person for a very long time. But I watched my boy Sivon do his squats like this, and this is how I did them last week. I was sore for four days instead of the one that I normally do. So here's what we want to do differently than a normal squat. You don't want your feet right underneath you. You want to kind of bring your feet like if my normal spacing is like right here, I want to bring my feet forward a little bit just so I'm focusing on my quads and my feet are a little bit closer than normal. And then it's just heels to butt a little lower than I go on a normal squat. And I'm just warming up right here. Yeah. 
And one thing with these is when I do normal squats, I typically am gonna get a down set where I get down to like three reps or so, but here I'm keeping the reps higher. All right, here we're going. Another warm up set, just so I can get myself comfortable here. complain about about these is I can't get up and wait as much when I barbell squat normally I get up to like 455 for my top set of three and here like three plates is about my max like I think last week I did three plates at a 10 for six six or eight but let's see what I got today <laughs> There was our set of 12. Now we got 10, 8, 8, 6. And we're done. So we got three plates on here. Going for 10. Let's get it. Can't forget to use protection, otherwise known as wearing a belt. <laughs> this is how you know the waist is getting smaller. We got one pin left on this. And I was stretching like three and four during the bulk. <sighs> Oh shit, dude. These are the these are the toughest thing ever. Yeah, my legs are already quivering. Holy that was 335. Three, yeah, 315 and two tens. 335 for eight. One more set of six right here. And then a set of eight. I think I misspoke before. One thing I can say. Is I hate coming to the gym past four. Like, I legit feel like an old man. Like, I just feel weaker. I come to the gym and it's like usually I'm coming three thirty. It's like my prime. It's like right after my third meal. It's like my head's right. I know I'm supposed to come at that time. 
And then I get in here today, and I freaking it's eight eight thirty, and I'm on my first exercise. Like, I don't know. I gotta stop this. But we gotta set the deal. Let's get it. One side of me right now is like, man, why am I here? Fourth of July, you know, could be spending some time with the fam. But then another side of me is like, today's a lot a day that a lot of kids are, their mom and dads are like, oh, it's Fourth of July, just you know, they like, take a day off. Like you can use today. It's a it's a holiday. You don't gotta lift on the holiday. That's what my parents used to tell me. But then you can look at today as an opportunity that another kid took off and you just got one step closer to being as good as that kid or maybe if you guys are even you just put yourself ahead of that kid so take these chances and opportunities to like put your set yourself over the edge like give yourself a advantage over kids who aren't doing this i mean it's an opportunity to have a cheat day or it's an opportunity to get better than somebody I chose to get better than somebody today. All right, here we go. Last set, set of eight. Took it down to 275 instead of 335 because I'm shot right now. Still get some work in, let's go. One more for that break. One more for that. We skipped the fucking gym today. All right. For my leg day, I do quads and hammies on the same day since I'm running the bro split. I just find it that I like to put them both on the same day, but what I will do, give myself a break. I go from a quad exercise to a hamstring exercise, back to a quad one. I think I got like four quad exercises and three hamstring ones on here, so. Next, we're doing, I think it's three sets of RDLs. Oddly enough, when I do RDLs with Smithy, I feel it. Hang on, I'm getting done with my set. My hamstring is it's on fire. I feel like I did something to it. But when I use dumbbells, I do not get the same feeling. Dumbbells, I don't feel anything. It feels like I did not do a single rep. So, that's why we're doing them this way. It's farther, by the way. My 
my god, it smells. Holy shit. Well, I guess you get one view of what a slow leprechaun butt looks like. Hopefully I didn't poop myself when I farted on my last set, because it's going to be a stain. No, I'm just kidding. Why did I say that? Uh, -huh. uh, here we are with the lovely pack squat. Not really. It's probably one of my least favorite things to do at the gym out of every workout. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Alright. Set of 10. Let's get it. Oh, yeah, nice and comfortable. Dig, dig, dig. <clears throat> Two more. Yeah. We got ourselves an aerial view. Ah. And Got another set of eight, keeping the weight the same right here. Am I happy about this right now? No, no, I hate hack squats. I hate them a lot. A lot, a lot. Last set of hack squats. Well, we're down to 275 here. Make sure we can get all of them. Another set of eight. Mm -hmm. Hope this. I hope you can see me right now. I kind of freeballed this camera angle. I feel like I'm gonna fart again, bro. <clears throat> oh, I lost count. I think it's six. One more for the kids who skipped the gym today. Alright, hamstring curls, three sets. Bang them out real quick.
set dose. I did 11, but no. But another set of 10 on the leg extensions after that, then half raises, and then we are done. So I came to a conclusion why I'm, uh, what's the word, why I'm passing gas right now. Um, eh, 1.30. Um, I had an extra serving of broccoli before I came. Typically, I saved the broccoli for the post-workout meal, but I came later today, so I had already eaten the meal for prior to coming. So, with two heads of broccoli, um, yeah, that's, that's gonna do it for you. That explains why they smell like, that's some <laughs> absolute <laughs> shit. So, leg extensions, during the bulk, I would do, I would do, uh, leg presses sometimes instead of leg extensions, because I feel like leg extensions is more of like a, um, detailing the quads kind of thing. And leg presses, hack squats, normal squats, Smith machine squats, Bulgarian split squats, all those things are more for um, like building the volume of your legs. And this is one thing that works on the detail. So try to get, we'll go 10 to 15 rep range for three sets right here. for the kid who didn't come today. Sheesh. One thing I like about leg extensions is it doesn't really matter the weight you use because I can slow my reps down and I can make 90 pounds burn just as much as 150 and Yeah, I got nothing else. We can officially say we're the last ones in the gym today. And it is 9.14. Trying out all the angles today. Last set. Oh my God, I'm pulling my hair. Last set. Let's get it. Oh shoot bro, come on you got more. <sighs> <sighs>
nothing. Nothing, nothing. Why does my foot start quivering? I gotta zoom that in. Okay, workout over. Successful leg day. My legs are walking out of the gym was uh, actually actually pretty shaky. So that's a good thing. We know we worked hard and this dude doesn't start riding my tail. I think I got some sort of, some sort of road rage because I get really mad and people are like, what are you doing? All right, I had some stuff I wanted to say, but I can't even remember right now. We got, uh, like I said, we got eight, almost nine weeks left of the cut. Making improvements every single day. Uh, only thing that sucks is I can't enjoy food right now because I don't get to eat a lot. Went to a cookout today and lots of brats, lots of burgers, lots of hot dogs. Lots of pasta salad. All my favorite things to eat. But I chose to stick to the plan. Because I'm, I don't know, this is in my head. This is just something that's in my head. But I could go on a diet for 10 weeks and look amazing compared to what it, when I started. And I could have one cheat meal and go back to the mirror and be like, man... I think I think I lost everything. Oh dear, 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 dear in the road. Two of them. Three of them. Um, where was I saying? Yeah. So I guess that's a form of body dysmorphia. But you're gonna have that if you go to the gym. It's not there's different levels to it. Like I got body dysmorphia to the lowest degree, like I'm good. I'm good. Tomorrow I got shoulders, and like I said, this was the second video I recorded of the bro split that I've been doing. So first I did arms last week, then this week I did legs. Next week I'm gonna try to do, well, I could do chest, which is on Mondays, Tuesdays is legs, Wednesdays is shoulders, Thursday is back, Friday is arms. So I could do anything besides legs or arms, and I feel like I post a lot of chest videos. So. We're probably going to do the shoulder day because shoulder day is my favorite day. Just a little news flash. I don't think I've ever heard anybody say, oh, yeah, shoulders is my favorite day. But it is mine. All right. Here's my new last meal of the day. It's very boring. But I switched up from the cottage cheese and grapes because in the cottage cheese there was 12 saturated fats for how much I, that I needed to hit my protein goals. So we got two rice cakes and right here we have Cajun protein. So I was talking about in a video a while ago how Cajun, uh, um, there's not a lot of foods that have Cajun protein in them and cottage cheese was one of them. So what do I do if I want to get rid of cottage cheese? I'll just get protein powder that's Cajun protein. Yeah. Chocolate tastes good. I add this to it. It's only 50 calories for two tablespoons because that protein is terrible. It's like drinking soap. It's really bad. So I add a tablespoon of chocolate to my water and we go one scoop, one heaping scoop into this one and one into this one. Why do I make it into two? Because I've tried multiple times drinking it in one. It, it is so disgusting, it's not even funny. So, I ordered five tubs of sebum protein last, yesterday afternoon. Vanilla oatmeal cookie, cinnamon toast crunch, birthday cake, and maple waffle. And I got two oatmeal cookies because mint chocolate chip sounds like butt. <laughs> so I mix these up, drink them, eat these two rice cakes, and that's it for the day. 2,800 calories right now. 
and we just drop from here. So I'm gonna eat this, go to bed, wake up tomorrow, hit shoulders. I might just record shoulders tomorrow if I'm feeling good or I'll wait a week. I don't know. All right, so we're three weeks into the cut, 23 days to be specific. If you're a normal person and you don't care about getting K's in protein like I do, you just want to be normal and you just want to be a kid that lifts and just makes progress, go get a different protein powder than this. Like, do not get this. I'm telling you right now, I got to blend this up and I got to drink it so fast while the water's still cold or else this tastes like it. But... Done. Now we got dessert. <laughs> dessert when I'm on the bulk is gonna be protein ice cream. I'm getting a ninja creamy. For now, dessert's an apple rice cake. Yum yum yum. Alright, get me out of here, bro. I'm done. Also, a lot of people said they want to see me talking more during my workout, so that's what I tried to do today. I'm gonna try to minimize the music. I might put a little bit in there. But yeah, I hope that. I hope today's workout was a little more enjoyable to watch. You know, maybe some, some background talking in there or whatever. But, yeah. Say so, I'll see you guys.